go. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. Good morning, Central School, and welcome to the KCSQ. I'm Kyle Pettis. And I'm Abby Brelli. And today is the D-Day. Today's lunch special is sweet and sour popcorn chicken. Right, just open up. Just go. Go. Good morning. During the month of November, we will focus on the character of citizenship. Please watch this video of Kid President where he discusses heroes and different acts that represent great citizenship. I'm going to teach you the whip and the nay nay. Okay, do me the whip and the what? The nay nay. And the nay nay. <laughs> okay. Hit it. <laughs> Today I'm starting a new series. I'm going to be talking about tough topics with grown ups. Today's tough topic how to be a hero. And today's grown up Tim Hanks. Yes. Uh, excuse me, Mr. Kid President. My name is not Tim Hong. I have a couple questions wow, for you. Wow, that is a lot of questions. Yeah, I was really excited to meet you, so I got a lot of questions. Okay. First question. Yes, Mr. Kid President. What do you think it takes to be a hero? You know, I once read that the definition of a hero is someone who voluntarily walks into harm's way. Now, maybe they're walking in to save somebody, like a fireman. Heroes. Teachers. Heroes. Wouldn't you agree? Yes, I would. There you go. This is the part of our interview where we dance. So can I teach you some dance moves? Nay, nay, you just put one arm in the air, and you just sway back and forth technique. That's it? <laughs> yep. That's the nay, nay? Didn't even need the glasses for that. So what's the whip? <laughs> the whip, you just go like that. You go like that? Yep. That's the whip? Yep. The whip and the nay, nay? Yep. Am I doing the whip and the nay, nay right now? Yeah. These are not challenging dance moves. Who are some of your favorite heroes from history? Do you know who Rosa Parks was, Mr. Kid President? Yep. Because it was actually the law at that time that a black woman had to give up her seat to anybody and sit in the back of the bus. That's a courageous American right there. Why do we celebrate heroes? I think it's in order to uh, celebrate the best parts of ourselves. I think at the end of the day, we are always looking for the best version of ourselves, meaning like we're always looking for those places where regular folks <clears throat> do the right thing because they do what a man has to do or a woman has to do. And I think when that happens, that deserves celebration because that might help other, inspire other people in order to be the best version of themselves. <laughs> I'd like your grade, please. I would give you 100. Thank you, Mr. Kid President. Thank you very much. This is a tough question, and I gotta figure this out. How can I be a hero to somebody? What can I do today? That's interesting. The option is probably there, Mr. Kid President. Now, maybe it would just be cutting somebody some slack. They've had a tough day and they need a break. And you can say, hey, it's all right, don't worry, I'm okay, I can wait. Something else might be something bigger than that, like returning something that was lost. I found this, and rather than rifle the contents of this wallet or purse, I'm gonna look at one thing in it, one thing only, and that is the driver's license of who it belongs to. And then you'd somehow get it back to them. Those are small little acts of heroism, but they're the right things to do. Straw battle. <laughs> what are we gonna do, fire him? Yes. Them. Don't you have to just give a little bit off like that? Oh, man, <laughs> that's cold. Did you really fire a spitball at me? No, I didn't. A bit off <laughs> Thank you, Tim Honks. You were, you were perfect. You are great. Answered all my questions. Although my name is not Tim Honks. The, oh, then what did I say? You said Tim Honks, and my name is Tom Hanks. I oh, will fix that in the edit. I'm, I'm so sorry. So pancake, subscribe. You guys, you can be heroes. Who will you stand up for today? Write in the comments below. Thank you, DreamWorks, for letting me meet Tom Hanks. Go see his new movie, Bridge of Spies.
It's right. KCS, think about what being a good citizen means to you. Now in school news, the chess club meeting will be next Tuesday, November 6th, after school in Mr. C's room, SU1. The next environmental club meeting will be tomorrow, October 2nd, after school in Mr. C's room, SU1. Digital art club will meet today after school in room 40. The KCS Student Council will have a meeting on Tuesday, November 6th, in Mrs. Andrews' room after school. The Digital Media Club will, have, will meet on Wednesday, November 7th, in the Makerspace with Mrs. Goldsmith after school. Congratulations to this month's Drama Class Actors of the Month. Kindergarten, Dante Bacon. First grade, Isabella Alberici. Second grade, Justina Salvanto. Third grade, Skylar Tate. And fourth grade, Madeline Monroe. Great job. All winter sports paperwork is due today. This includes boys and girls basketball, cheerleading, and wrestling. Please see your coaches. Thank, Thank you, you and have, have a great day. day.